I'm Darren and this is my colleague Lee and today I'm going to play the role of the clinician and Lee is going to play the role of the patient in this demonstration of an ocular VEMP. Now Lee doesn't have any previous balance issues and neither is he reporting any symptoms today. We've conducted an audiogram so his hearing is satisfactory in both sides and we've also done a middle ear assessment using wideband tympanometry. So now we're going to get his skin prepared ready for the ocular VEMP. Now in the literature there are two montages that are referred to. Some uh, may be more familiar with the traditional montage where we place the electrodes, both electrodes underneath each eye. Today we're going to use the, what's called the alternative montage. So we're going to place electrodes under each eye, but we're also going to place an electrode just on the bridge of the nose. This is also seen on the chin in some montage descriptions. So let's get the skin prepared. So we'll take some new prep. We don't need a great deal here just to prepare the skin. So we'll take a little pea size amount and then start preparing the skin. So we're going to rub in the areas where we're going to place our electrode montage. So one up at the top here where we're going to place the ground, bridge of the nose, and then underneath each eye. So now sometimes we can get the patient to look up to do this. We can also just pull the skin to create a little tighter area just to prepare. And now we're ready to put our electrodes into position. So we're using surface electrodes. We'll place our ground in position, just squeezing around the outside so we don't remove any of the conductive gel. Place one on the bridge of the nose. Again, trying to keep this nice and central. Use this for the reference for both the right and the left side and then underneath the eye. Now because we can't see the inferior oblique muscle, we look at the central part of the eye and the montage suggests that we just place sweeping out to the side. So place that in position. Now, it's delicate skin under the eye, so we do have to be careful as we place them and being mindful of eyelashes as well. Patients are looking up to help us. We can place and just gently Make sure it's secure on the surface of the skin. And that's our montage complete. Now we're ready to actually attach the electrodes. So now we'll take our preamplifier, place on the neck loop aura, and get ready to attach our electrodes. So let's first take the ground electrode, place that behind the ear just to try and keep things tidy. Click into position. Next, we'll take the electrode we're placing on the bridge of the nose. Again, keeping that tidy. Now, the trick with this is that we know with the ocular vent, it's a crossed uh, response. So we're placing the right electrode actually underneath the left eye. We can tidy that. And that leaves us with the electro left electrode to place around and underneath the right eye. Okay, and then we will check for our impedances. And those are nicely balanced at around four kilo ohms.